Message from August 2022 The Lord began Overcome with me, your future is bright, your destiny firm. All that lies ahead is sure and true. Do not allow yourself to dwell on mistakes. You continually still do it and it will do battle to overcome them gradually. Give your little tiny effort that you can muster and have recourse to me, my child. Far too little you rely on me and try too many times on your own weakness. Yes, I do see you trying, but cultivate a dependence on me, my dear little one. Then Saint Teresa of Lisieux popped in and said, Don't shut us down because we feel shut down and insensitive. We are there and we listen. We are ready to aid you all, if only you would just remember us. I am here to aid you in your walk. No wonder you saw us together in the start before you sailed off to America. <laughs> she mentions as an aside, which I had a vision, an encounter in the spirit with her before I went to the mountain. Therese continued. They, God, were showing you your partner of trust in walk, secondary to all coming before her. <laughs> she chuckled. I know it is difficult to yield and submit one's will to the Lord, but it is so to train and bend the soul, better now than never. It is needed. Much depends on obedience to His will, she said. Then Jesus took over. Do not be dismayed, and don't be so down at your own inabilities and faults. Again, dear one, again and again I repeat to you, overcome with me. Be my child whom I adore and let all else go and rest in my fatherly hands. Even your faults and mistakes, all of it. You need to learn how to be joyful inside again. Far too many times it is robbed from you by a single thought. Be more firm than they. Be more stout hearted than them. You have my power within you. You have your will and you decide whom to listen and whom not to. You can shut their mouths instantly by refusing their suggestions, illusions, lies, anything. This is how they feed off souls. Resist and yield to me. I will help you. Many times you just rush presumptuously on what you think is timing. Would you learn to wait on me? I then became scrupulous, thinking that I do not obey, but delay. The Lord continued and replied, You will sense it. You are in a state of inner martyrdom right now, where nothing seems to flow through and stumbling, driven from one side to another. But I hold you. I hold you tight to me in the course of it all. Truly do all I have told you to do and it will be well with you. Kick hopelessness in the teeth and point with confidence to your king. Let him know you are a child of the king who shapes you to be a queen, meek and humble of heart, after me. Stay close to me no matter the stages you are in. I do not change. Pray, hope, and don't give up. Rather, thank me for allowing this to happen now. I am in the process of manning you up. 